and thanks for signing into this uh, Adobe Spark e-learning resource. For those of you who feel as if you're fighting fire with fire at the moment, um, given the current demands placed on us by um, the COVID-19 pandemic, then some of you may be wondering how you're going to take your uh, classroom or lecture hall presence and put that into a really effective e-learning format. For those who work at universities where they have whole teams to do this, that's not going to be too much of a problem at all. The teachers normally design what they want the students to learn. Then there could be a whole backup team providing the e-learning resources. For many of you, however, you might be used to using your virtual learning environment just as a repository for so many resources. So you may be putting your PowerPoints or Prezi's on there and uh, handbook, PDFs, that sort of thing. You put those on there, but that's just facilitating a very uh, passive way of learning for your students. So what this resource is going to do is look at, look at ways in which you can turn your classroom presence into a really effective online presence as well, and look at the ways of overcoming some of the challenges faced by students who usually approach online work as a passive form of learning. So how are we going to flip that around and move from passive learning into active learning? And that's what we look at throughout this resource. Thanks so much for joining me.